Are you considering leveraging an influencer marketing strategy within your B2B business this year? I'll share with you why that might be such a good idea for your business. and welcome back to my channel. My name's Eva and I've been Customer Success Director at Onalytica for the past two years and I've helped some of the largest B2B enterprise brands build hugely successful influencer marketing programs. They've driven 30 times brand awareness and engagement and up to five times demand gen by leveraging an influencer marketing program. That means I also know what makes programs go wrong and you can catch that in one of my next videos on how to make B2B influencer marketing work for you. But if you're still considering implementing this, I'll be sharing with you why influencer marketing can be such a great strategy. Let's get to it. Now, I don't want you to just take my word for it because obviously I work in the space but I encourage you to look at top rank study on the state of influencer marketing, which has shown that of the marketers that were investing in B2B marketing, 90% of them are either maintaining the spend or increasing the spend for 2021. So that is an example of people putting their money where their mouth is. It's a growing industry. A lot of brands had tried it a few years ago just to see whether it would work. But the proof that brands are increasing their spend just goes to show that they're driving great results from it. The second reason that influencer marketing works so well is the fact that people no longer trust brands. A 2017 study which analyzed a constant set of well-known brands shows that brand trust was at 44% in 2001 and that plummeted to 18% by 2017. And that's only gonna continue to drop. People who are experts within the field or people like me for a lot of your uh, target audience have become more and more credible and that's shown by Edelman's Trust Barometer. So being able to leverage other industry practitioners, other influencers or experts in the field to help with your brand messaging is going to do wonders for your brand awareness and for your credibility. It also will help you to change your content because unfortunately, your content can be really boring. <laughs> um, and that's just feedback from a lot of customers. Now, when they look at just another set of branded content, which is talking about just us and what we do, they're not interested, they've stopped paying attention, they've stopped listening. How an influencer can help with that is the fact that they already have credibility within their field and they're talking about thought leadership. So if you want to create better content that's talking about thought leadership, bring in an influencer to the work that you're doing. They can not only help to co-create fantastic content, which I guarantee will get more eyes on it from your target audience, but they can also help you with insights from their audience, from everything that they've learned into how you can tailor your messaging so it really targets your audience that much better. Reason number four, it's quite simple really, your competitors are doing it. And I get that it might be risky as a strategy that you haven't tried before, but especially if you're working in the B2B tech space, we're probably already working with one of your competitors who's leveraging an influencer marketing program. Now, if, you, if there isn't a competitor in your space already doing this, then that's a wonderful opportunity for you to dominate the market as a thought leader. So make sure you keep up and start working with influencers. Influencer marketing is a brand building activity. So in addition to supporting you to drive much better results for a lot of your campaigns, it also makes your brand seem that much more credible. We've seen businesses who have built advocates over a long period of time, we've seen those advocates step in when there's a major PR crisis with the brand. So you want to make sure that you're building a community of advocates, but that you're also associating your brand with thought leaders and thought leadership themes. 
Your customers are not waiting around for your next campaign in order to make their buying decision. They'll know when they need to make that decision. So making sure that you're always staying front of mind by creating regular content with influencers who are going to influence that target audience will mean that you're the first person they think of when it comes to making that decision. If that's piqued your interest and you'd like to find out more about how you can run an effective B2B influencer marketing strategy, then don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell and also catch my next video on the seven secrets to running an effective strategy. I hope you enjoyed this and I'd love to see your thoughts in the comments down below. Thanks for watching.